Well, happy Robbie Burns Day. Wine and spirits expert Christopher Waters joins us and takes us on a journey from traditional to modern scotches to celebrate the day. Good morning. Happy New Year. Good to see you. <laughs> Good morning, Bob. Great to see you as well. So, first of all, um, in 40 minutes or less, can you <laughs> tell us <laughs> about Robbie Burns and Robbie Burns Day? Well, Rob, Robbie Burns, I mean, it, the, the man, of the, you know, considered to be one of the greatest Scots ever, uh, a day that was originally made to celebrate him has become a celebration of Scottish culture uh, globally. And a big part of that, of course, is Scotch whiskey. Now, Scotch has certainly evolved over the years. The, the branding has changed, too. I mean, it, it used to be an imagery, or at least I had an imagery, like to drink Scotch, you had to have a thick sweater and look like Hemingway. But now... Like, <laughs> It, it's uh, it's appealing to the masses now. Indeed, yeah, I mean, my beard hasn't grown in, and I don't, yeah, <laughs> I, I don't have the turtleneck to, to pull it off. But I mean, blended scotch is what something we're going to start with. Johnny Walker, Black Label, brand champion, made to be, uh, ma had made to have mass appeal, made to have consistent flavor, batch by batch, blends all corners of Scotland together. This was scotch for so many years, and then the single malts came along very small base in the 70s, maybe 30 of them total. Today, there's probably 500 different single malt expressions, including okay, when some you of the say single, When you say single malt, so what is that yeah. exactly? It's one distillery, one who makes it from start to finish, as opposed mm -hmm. to the jo friends from Johnny Walker going around Scotland, going, I'll take that barrel, I'll take that barrel. We're going to knit together to make one harmonious spirit that always tastes like Johnny Walker Black Label. The folks at Talisker, who make this lovely 10-year-old expression, they want to showcase what Talisker is all about, what this one patch on the Isle of Skye can deliver in a dram of scotch. And that's something that's smooth, yes, that's a, that's a note word for scotch across the range, but also spicy and intense and has some real richness and character to it. Okay, uh, we often think of scotch you know, is served neat with maybe a drop of water. Yeah. But um, cocktails, there's, there's many options. Indeed, I think the whole, me the whole messaging of, of mixology has been that, yes, you can have your scotch with a drop of water, with your whiskey stones, because you don't want any water, nothing at all, just completely neat <laughs> like this glass of Leg of Ulan 8 here. Or you can use it as a high premium ingredient in a really great cocktail. And so it's your scotch. How do you want to appreciate it? How do you want to enjoy it? Instead of being a very cerebral kind of led by the head thing, it's now led by the heart and you can enjoy this however you want. And so something like Lagavulin 8, it's got such a distinctive flavor. For some people, that's going to be the sweet spot. They love the intensity of it. For others, let's dial that intensity down. Let's get that richness, but also let's add some citrus or maybe some ginger to it and then we'll get something that's a bit more palatable for their taste yeah so um for purists like is there does it just come down to taste or is like single malt considered superior or yeah it's a great question i mean i think single malt they're dramatic and they're distinctive and it's about finding a a, a cut of cloth that fits you just right so, you know that jacket that that hits your shoulders or, or or, and, and makes your complexion look great. It, it, there's so many dramatically different styles, and that's why I picked a range to showcase a bit of Scotland. But even, actually, I took a divergence, and we're going to go to Ireland quickly, because this quiet man is something that's coming out in the Ontario markets very soon, and it's a very different experience. It's mellow. To me, this is like the weighted blanket of the whiskey world. And for some people, that's what they're looking for in a whiskey experience. <laughs> I love that, they, the weighted blanket of the whiskey world. It's just mellow and smooth, and it's not too challenging. And so it's just something that you can just, if that's the experience you want, it's a very different experience from the intensity of the Lagavulin 8 or the richness of the Talisker 10. Okay, well, I think that should go in the ad. That sold some bottles right there. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we'll link up your website uh, with more on all these great offerings, and uh, always great to see you. Uh, Christopher Waters, and uh, happy Robbie Burns Day. Happy Robbie Burns Day to you, and I'll cheers you out with the Brunewag and a lovely light spirit from Islay. Cheers. Cheers, virtually.